So, if that was a test, what do you suppose it was testing exactly? Filling a bucket? I had to know about St. Dismas, whom I bet Avery and all of his crew were intimately familiar with. <laughs> not that hard of a test. Maybe it's not the only one. Okay, I'm guessing we need to get up to that broken bridge. Good guess. Let's look for a way up. Hey, come here. I'll boost you up there. Coming. Okay, I got something for you up here. Use this to reach those handholds on the wall over there. Good call. Sure not making this easy, are they? I imagine it was easier when all the bridges and walkways weren't broken. <laughs> I guess we're a couple hundred years late. Let's see what's in here. Hey, there's a low ceiling here. Watch, Watch my ah? Uh, you need me to slow down for you? This way. Yeah, maybe through here. I see some light through here. Ah, oh, catacombs. Well, that makes sense. We're under a cathedral. Anything noteworthy by the dormitories? Not unless you count some cleverly worded headstones. Have you finished digging by the chapter house? We have, ma'am. The northwest sites are wide open as well. And what about the southern perimeter? Not yet. It'll take us a day to move the crane over there. Nadine. Make it happen. In the meantime, see what you can dig up without it. I'll send a couple of men over right away. Good. Rafe, any luck with those manuscripts? Can we have a minute? Keep me updated. Yes, ma'am. Did you hear? They found a whole annexed area under the cathedral. I did. Have you seen it? No. Why? Because there wasn't much left after they'd finished finding it. My men have been a bit liberal with They're the gold like line. like a hundred well-armed bulls in a china shop. But they've made more progress in two days than we've made in months. Progress? I can't analyze rubble. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I'll let them know they need to give you a heads up before they do anything drastic. 
Or you can tell them to sit tight until I analyze the few clues that haven't been blown up. No, we can't sit around waiting any longer. All due respect, I think I have a bit more experience with this sort of thing than you do. We tried things your way. Bullshit. You've been wanting to level this place ever since we got here. No! I wanted to steal that cross long before it ever even made it to that auction. The same auction where I couldn't have my men around to deal with any surprises. The auction was the cleanest way but to get the cross. But instead of going with my gut, I'll listen to you. And now we have competition. Oh, well, I didn't think he'd show up. Or maybe you wanted to draw him out. <laughs> Why the hell would I do that? Because you think you need him. And maybe you do. Point is, I'm done trying to do things the clean way. If the treasure is here, we'll find it. And if not, well... Maybe it's time to move on, huh? It's not personal. Of course. I'll let you know if anything turns up. Let's get moving before they blow that treasure to bits. Oh, let's start making out. <laughs> Wait. You think she was right, though? But what? About Rafe, want to draw you out. As long as he doesn't get the upper hand, who cares? Doesn't matter. What annexed area you suppose they were talking about? There's gotta be some side chamber because we're the only ones here. Uh, a little too high to jump up there unless you got a trampoline. <laughs> Left it in my backyard. Oh, Don. Wait, do you, do you have a trampoline? <laughs> I wish. There's a path back there.
Hang on. Look at you. One crate coming up. I thank you, good sir. Definitely getting closer to the cathedral. I don't know what's left of it. Gotta say, this is far more sophisticated than I was expecting. <laughs> Me too. Must have taken years to build. Bridge is out. Gotta find another way across. Here goes nothing. Good thing you're not heavier than the crate. Okay. Made it. What's the plan? I'm working on it. Hook our ropes onto this. That'll work. Needs bridges. Oh no, I I wouldn't mind bridges per se. Well, can't go through there. So how do we get through? Over here. If the place wasn't completely falling apart, we'd probably be trapped again. Nathan, look around you. Holy crap. This must have been another test, but it all just crumbled into the ocean. Well, I guess the test now is... How the hell do we get to the other side? That really safe looking wooden seesaw thing might do the trick. Worth a shot. <laughs> Here goes nothing. Whoa, whoa. Nathan, Nathan, stop. You won't make it. You're too low. I'll weigh it down. Go. Made it! All right. Uh, now, what about me? Right, uh, just let me look around. 
Cole. Yeah. Cole, I'll just hang out here. Check out all that machinery. You know, it really makes you appreciate everything that goes into making one of these death traps. <laughs> Don't be glib. Any luck? Yeah, give me a sec. Okay, I found something to weigh down the seesaw. Heavier than I am. I don't know about that. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Hey, nice air time. Uh, well, if treasure hunting doesn't work out, we can always join the circus. Uh, not if they have clowns. Now, well, still not over that, huh? No one is. Crap! I got you. There. Thanks. There's another test down. Yeah, at this point, I'd rather take another death trap. At this point, I hope we're at the end of this thing. Come on. Okay. Getting a bit dramatic with the statues here. Seriously, why decorate a treasure burial site or build elaborate tests? Ugh. I'll never get used to this. Another cross. <laughs> At least this one has some jewels on it, right? Whoa, whoa, don't touch it. What? Why? <laughs> Look at it. It's the only valuable thing we've seen in this cave. Right. This is another test. Agreed. Yeah. Or lack thereof. Okay, so. It's, it's gotta be the coins. Yeah. Are we sure about this? Oh, pretty sure. Pretty sure we'll have to do. Right, just, just one now. Great, I got it. Please don't be a trap. Recognize the shape? It's Madagascar. Look, star right here. It's King's Bay. Yes, it is. <laughs> Son of a bitch. He's screwing with us. What are you talking about? Avery, he's screwing with us. This was supposed to be it, so where's the goddamn treasure, huh? I mean, Kings Bay, great. Well, what's next? North Pole? Outer space? Nathan. For those who prove worthy, paradise awaits. He, he was recruiting. Who was recruiting? Avery was recruiting. Recruiting for what? <laughs> <laughs> You gentlemen are very, very noisy. Guns on the floor. Slowly. Must have you from last time. Yeah, throw me out a window didn't do it for you? Rafe. Rafe, come in. I'm at the graveyard. Nadine, hey, we're here. Yeah, I'm looking at them right now. What? Where are you? Come back to the cathedral. Follow the holes. I'm on my way. And for God's sakes, don't shoot him yet. <laughs> Not want to hurry then. King's Bay. Yeah, but, uh, where in King's Bay? You'll need that cross over there to figure it out, but there's only two people that can tell you how to use it. Let me guess. 
You too. Well, I'll leave it to Rafe. You're gonna be waiting a long time. Sorry, boys. I'm not here to negotiate. Bring me the crucifix. It's not a crucifix. What? Well, technically, a crucifix refers to cross that. You know what? Never mind. Don't touch it! Punched it and set it on fire. Story. Short version is get us the hell out of here. Yeah, drink it. Hold tight. Be there as soon as I can. Oh, the hell.
Set her down. One way or another, we'll get to you.
close one, huh? They shot up my goddamn plane, mate. We're fine, thanks. How soon can you get us to Madagascar? No treasure, then. Not yet. I don't know what you're talking about. Look, we're rich. Jesus. I suppose it's a start. You think the rest is in Madagascar? Well, there was a chamber back there with a giant map of Madagascar on the floor, so... Yeah, it's probably there. This is beginning to smell a whole lot like wild goose, kid. Look, the treasure was never in Scotland, okay? Then what was the point of all that, huh? Of the St. Dismas Look, Cross? it's like I said. I think Avery was recruiting people. The cross was an invitation. The caves were just some sort of uh, initiation. Oh, so we all passed, huh? Congrats, Victor. We get eye patches and parrots now. I don't get it. Why the hell would they go to all that bother just to weed people out? To protect himself. Look, Avery was the most wanted man in the world at that time. He had to enlist people that he could trust in order to keep their treasure secret. What do you mean, their treasure? I, I just think about this. Thomas, too, was a successful pirate in his own right. What would he possibly stand to gain from joining Avery? I think Avery sent out crosses only to the other wealthy pirates like himself. What if they pooled and hid all their treasure together? That would make the guns way all look like chump change. Exactly. Oh, holy shit. Okay, so we're exactly in Madagascar. Are we going? Kings Bay. It was an old pirate haven back in uh, Avery's time. I know it well. It's a big place. Anything more specific? Well, that map chamber completely caved in, so, you know. <laughs> what are you laughing about? The people who survived the caves, the recruits. What's the one thing they would have left with? There's a volcano on this. <laughs> There's a volcano near King's Bay. Which means we need to get a move on. Hey. Hey, Nate. Hi, honey. Oh, hi. I've been trying to get a hold of you. Are you okay? Yeah, of course. What do you mean? Well, you know, the news. There's been all that flooding. Maybe going to Malaysia during the monsoon season wasn't such a good idea. Yeah, right. Right, yeah, it, uh, it grounded us for sure. You know, had some equipment failure, but, you know, no one's hurt or anything. Well, as long as you guys are safe. So are you going to start work tomorrow? Uh, postponed, actually. Uh, looks like we're going to need maybe another 10 days or so. Ugh, 10 days? Hey, well, I, why don't I just uh, go ahead and buy a ticket then? Oh, you know, you don't have to do that. That's fine. I mean, you know, these guys always overestimate things. I'm, I'm sure it'll be less time than that. Okay, well, you know, don't rush. Make sure that you're safe. Oh, I will. Always do. Uh, listen, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I gotta go. Jameson's calling me over. Okay. I love you. Love you, too. What are the satellites saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Okay. All right. So, what are we looking for out here? Well, the map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. Angus crossed. 
see some ruins up ahead. Wait here. I'll go take a look. Oh, Victor. <laughs> Still do a lot of traveling these days. Yeah, I try. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <laughs> yeah, I was telling Nathan it's shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of hot cargo now. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. Get a good read on them. Hard to do that in a chat room talking to some guy named Antiquity Master 37. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. <laughs> to see here. Well, nah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest format. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. That bridge there is what you would call rigged. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. I just keep, keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going. On. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus. Christ. Onward and upward. We're getting nowhere fast. You need traction here. No, turn into it. Nathan, the rocks. I got it, I got it. <laughs> I got mud in my mouth. <laughs> Spin out now. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. No, turn into it. There we go. <laughs> Tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. 
going off road. It might rain, might be muddy. How about we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch? Take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, Two, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe, uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. Check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. <laughs> Sam, look. That's... Christopher Condon's sigil is uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. Well, maybe each captain was responsible for a tower, along with providing the men for it. Whatever the case, <sighs> this certainly isn't our final stop on our tour. stripped away. Something was wrapped around this tree. came with a winch? No, oh, really? I didn't know. What you gonna do with it? Not sure yet. Do it. Oh, oh, oh. Ah. Oh, that looked like fun. Steeper than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We clear the hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine, you've come here. A well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. <laughs> Those poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live 
as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. It's taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor, patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Damn. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. But the point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah, well, still taking a long time. Would you look at that? Oh shit! Stop! Stop! I see him. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. And that means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight to them. Oh, shit. You do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. Get out of here. Well, we'll worry about that after we deal with this shoreline, Coon. <sighs>
Okay. I think that's it. God damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. Let's not get stuck here. <clears throat> Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Ray? Now, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. This thing in the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, I mean, you're right. Hey, Sam. You don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard, saw me as a charity case, I guess. He'd uh, check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. Pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way. Check it out, boys. What is it? Guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline, Mercs? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge? How medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to keep people out. Or protect something inside. Check this out. The hell, the stairs are busted. There's no way up to the crank. I'll see if I can find something to stand on. <laughs> Another sigil. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. And Bonnie. Hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. I thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her too. 